Here we go again. Russell Westbrook. At this point, bro. At this point, Westbrook. You're never going to win a championship. I feel like Westbrook, Dressbrook, Russell Dressbrook is more worried about fashion, wearing skirts, wearing dresses more than he is about playing basketball. He's smiling harder right here than he does on the basketball court. It's always the black men. I wonder if there's any white athletes, any white actresses, actors, entertainers that's at this event that's wearing a skirt. Or is it just the black men? The young black men, huh? I want to ask y'all a question. Westbrook is Do y'all think Westbrook is Pushing an agenda Do you think he's Just expressing himself Through fashion Or you think he little sussy dussy You know what <clears throat> In all honesty right in my opinion, I don't think he's sussy dussy. Nah. I think R Russell Dressbrook, <laughs> Dress Brick, <laughs> Russell Dress Brick, I think Russell Dress Brick is 100% heterosexual. I truly think that. Is he expressing himself? Could be. Could he be a part of the agenda of demasculating young black men? I'm really starting to think that. Do you think he actually paid for that? Let me ask y'all a question while I put my visa line in. I had to make sure I got my food out of my mouth because I just ate. Do you think he actually paid for that? How tall is Russell Res uh, Dress Brick? How tall is Russell Dress Brick? He's about 6'7". 6'3". Six, 6'3". Six, six, three, six, three. Okay, so he's not too too tall, tall. <laughs> this nigga looks straight out of a Harry Potter book, bro. This nigga looks straight out of a Harry Potter book. Like a rabbit is about to come from that hat. He looked like he about to pull out a Smith and Western. Like he about to go wild, wild. I mean, look, man, Russell, bro. I really don't care for you anymore. You, you actually suck. You was exposed this year for. Okay, I'm. I'm not going to hate. I'm, I'm not going to say you suck, but you definitely was exposed this year, right? You were definitely exposed this year on the basketball court. You're not as good as you think you are. 
your basketball IQ is of a 10 year old child your jump shot is of a nine year old soccer player your athleticism is amazing but you're not you're not as good as you think you are and playing with a team as the Lakers pretty much exposed you and it looks like you have more passion about fashion than you do on the basketball court so you know what I really don't care much about you Westbrook you will never win a championship in your life you will never win a championship never and I hope you never do Because I honestly think, me personally, I honestly think he's a heterosexual man. But I also think that he's getting paid to do this. Allegedly. That's my opinion. I'm thinking that he's getting paid to do this. Do y'all think he actually spent his money? Or did somebody maybe allegedly, allegedly, I think I snapped, sponsored him? Let me see something real quick. I, I just want to see if there was any white. What's this? 2022. Were there any white people, white men wearing dresses? Um, let's see. Um, God damn, that's Kim K. Damn, you fine as hell, boy. Sheesh. Gonna lie to you. Okay. I'm just I'm just trying to see if I see any white god damn Kim K. I ain't gonna lie. Even though you half is all GMO, shit, I'll, I'll still hit. I ain't gonna lie. Hold on, let me see 2022 men fashion. I just wanna put men fashion. Let me see what comes up. Meet, meet the red carpet. Best dress. Okay. Oh, wow. He looks very masculine. Wow. White boy looks very masculine right here. Look very sharp, my man. Oh, another non-white person. Looking very sharp. Looking, looking spiffy. Another Tom Ford. Wow, you look very sharp. Very debonair. Very, very uh, masculine. <laughs> Justin, I, I see you, my nigga. All right. Then we go to the black Negroes. All right, so he got the MC Hammer pants on. All right, I mean, at least he ain't got a skirt on. Another very weird man, but he's in a tuxedo. Sharp, sharp. Okay, so, 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 all right, hey, hey, you know what I mean, hey, hey, still, still cool, you know what I mean, even though he has a, uh, lamp header on his head, you know, even, even though he, he has a, um, black plate on his head, it's, it's still, you know, hey, sharp, sharp, okay, sneakers on, okay, okay, hey, it's still, but I'm trying to figure out if I see any white men wearing skirts. Okay, that's, I mean, but still, it's, it's not a skirt. Okay. Okay. Well, he's, he's probably one of those. He's probably one of those, so, you know. Okay, but, 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 but. For the most part, it seems like <laughs> always got to be the black man, right? They black men got to look the most feminine. Why is it that the black man has to look the most feminine? But all the white guys, they are sharp. They are sharp. Look at them. <laughs> oh, why? Why is it that all the black 
black people just look like they just doing extra. Okay, here we go. We got this dude right here wearing a skirt. So we got one guy. Oh my God, kid cutting. <laughs> D-Wade, bro, I ain't. Y'all leave a comment down below, man. Do you think... Now, this is not his first rodeo wearing a dress, all right? This is... Just type in dress. Russell Dress Brick. <laughs> Russell Dress Brick wearing a dress. I mean... That ain't bad. Real cool. Russell, you just, you just real lame to me. I'm sorry. You just real lame to me. I, but honestly, I think he's a heterosexual man. Definitely getting paid to wear that outfit. That's what I'm going to say. I think he's definitely getting paid to wear that outfit. Y'all leave a comment down below. Westbrook, you ain't going to never win a championship. And I hope you never do. Shout out to Russell Dress Brick. <laughs> That's your new name. Russell Dress Brick. <laughs> we out of here, y'all. <laughs>